Against the backdrop of COVID, we're all becoming more accustomed to living with change. Change can be unsettling. Dealing with change can be tiring. But change can also be incredibly exciting and positive. I'm Kate Fox, one of the new co-managers of the Keystone Positive Change Investment Trust. My colleagues and I were delighted to become managers of the trust in February 2021, following the board's bold decision to adopt radical and positive change. Radical change in transforming the trust from a UK one to a global one with ambitious growth aspirations. And positive change by becoming a trust that doesn't just seek to deliver attractive investment returns, but one that also seeks to contribute towards a more sustainable world for us to retire into and for our grandchildren's grandchildren to thrive in. These two objectives are highly complementary, and we believe that they provide a great opportunity for savers, people and planet. By investing in the Keystone Positive Change Investment Trust, you're investing in a selection of companies whose products and services are providing solutions to global challenges. A particularly exciting aspect of the trust is its ability to invest in private companies. So as shareholders, this provides you the opportunity to supply primary capital to some of the world's most innovative and ambitious young companies. To introduce you to some of the companies that we invest in on your behalf, let me take you through some of the exciting areas of research and recent portfolio activity. We need to rapidly decarbonize energy generation. As the world's largest offshore wind farm operator, Orsted plays an important role in the shift towards more renewable energy. Renewable energy generation will enable electrification in many industries, one of the most prominent being transportation. Tesla is a key contributor to the electrification of the automotive industry, there is also a great deal of investment and innovation going into developing electric flying vehicles. And last year, the trust took a new holding in Joby, a pioneer in this area. We're living in a material world, but the current system is unsustainable. We can't continue on this linear system of extraction, use and disposal, particularly of products derived from rare materials and petrochemicals. We need to use better materials and to keep goods in the system for longer, to move from a linear to a circular economy. Northvolt is a private Swedish company that we recently took a holding in. As well as aspiring to become Europe's biggest battery provider, it is intent on recycling batteries from EVs, so helping us move to a more circular system. And Spiber is an exciting private Japanese company that we've also recently invested in, which makes biodegradable fibres that share the attractive qualities of animal fibres such as cashmere or petrochemical-based products, but are much more environmentally sustainable. We believe that we're living through a biological revolution and that's through tools that help us read, edit, and write DNA. The Trust invests in a few companies that provide tools that enhance our understanding of biology and have the scope to improve our understanding, diagnosis, and treatment of diseases. Examples include Illumina and 10X Genomics. Investments that address the healthcare and quality of life theme vary, from vaccine provider Moderna to Peloton, which we took a new holding in last year. Peloton has carved out a unique position in the interactive fitness market and has got a huge runway for growth. By reducing the friction of keeping fit, Peloton is helping prevent the onset of several conditions such as heart disease and type 2 diabetes. Access to high quality education is a key enabler of social mobility and economic progress. We are delighted to have participated in the IPO of Coursera, an online platform providing a range of educational content, from short courses to online degrees, helping improve access to learning through lower costs and greater convenience, and helping provide relevant qualifications in an ever-evolving job market. These exciting new purchases have been funded from selling companies where the investment case hasn't worked out, and companies like Alphabet, where we no longer believe that the company will meet our impact objective. We've also reduced positions in companies where we believe the share price appreciation has been particularly strong and outstripped the fundamental progress, such as Tesla and ground source heat pump provider Niebuhr. It feels as if we are on the cusp of several waves of innovation and transformation, including the energy transition, electrification, a material revolution, genetics, AI, and quantum computing. Each of these waves in isolation are exciting. In combination, they could be incredibly powerful. So our focus is on identifying the wave makers, the companies that are driving change and disrupting the status quo and to play our role in helping the development and scaling of innovative solutions to global challenges by providing long-term and supportive capital. We thank you for joining us on what we believe to be an important and rewarding journey for savers, people and planet.